All right, squirrel guys here. I want to show you a few things that's going on. The roof here, uh, our entry point is right here where squirrels are getting in or appear to be squirrels, as you can see. So we have that. We have two little roof returns on either side of the roof right up here. As you can see, there's been some chewed wood that the squirrels have uh, been chewing on. So they know that that weak spot in the roof is there. On our plumbing vents, they're completely disintegrated. And you can tell they're leaking and the wood around it is starting to rot. We have a lot of exposed nails, which also create interior leaks. We have an open plumbing vent, whereas if something was to get stuck in here, it could not get out. You have to call a plumber and I'm sure it's a lot more expensive than what we do, which is put a screen on top of the plumbing vent. It allows it to still ventilate, but nothing to get in. We have a few of these plumbing vents on the roof here. A lot of exposed nails that need to be sealed in that way. Actually, squirrels have been chewing on this plumbing vent itself. You can tell this in the video here. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, got several plumbing vents here. All of them are in very poor condition. The roof has some blistering going on, which means it gets too hot and there's not enough at, uh, ventilation. And I don't see any ventilation at all on this roof. Um, there should be either ridge vent, uh, box vents, a power vent, something like that, and there's nothing. So you can see all this cracking going on. Those are blisters where the roof gets too hot in the summer. And uh, so that's a, kind of a problem. We also have down here, be careful with me, it's a little steep. Some issues going on here at the soffit. Careful, it's a little steep. All right, this one's okay. Which one was it? It must be the ones over here. And be careful here, going over. Okay. Okay. Right here, there's some rotten wood. And watch this. I can just take my whole hand all the way through and it's completely loose. So squirrels could definitely get right through that. Um, <coughs> there's another entrance over here. And there's already a hole, as you can see here in the video. So right here, we see a lot of nesting going on from the attic. There's a minor gap that goes along. This might be all right, but probably needs to be sealed up. So we have that. Um, so far, this will conclude my video for my inspection and uh, get you guys an estimate to get these squirrels out. Thanks for watching the squirrel guys.